The couple have produced just one podcast series since signing with Spotify in 2020 for a reported twenty million United States dollars. The multi-million dollar deal that a media group run by Prince Harry and his wife Meghan, the Duchess of Sussex, has had with streaming giant Spotify is ending by mutual agreement, the two parties said on Thursday. The couple have produced just one series under their Archwell Audio podcast imprint since inking the agreement in 2020 for a reported twenty million United States dollars. Fifteen pounds. Six meters or twenty nine point one million Australian dollars. That show, The Duchess's Archetypes, has topped podcast charts for the outlet in a number of markets, with listeners flocking to her discussions with influential women. But the two sides said in a joint statement that the deal is coming to an end. Spotify and Archwell Audio have mutually agreed to part ways and are proud of the series that we made together, the statement said. Variety cited an unnamed source who said Spotify had been expecting more content from Archwell Audio while another unnamed source said Harry and Meghan wanted to move away from exclusive Spotify distribution to find a new home for their audio projects. Archwell Audio's company mission is, producing programming that uplifts and entertains audiences around the world, as well as, spotlights diverse perspectives and voices, and, builds community through shared experience, narratives and values. Last year, Barack and Michelle Obama also ended their deal with Spotify to exclusively distribute their podcast Higher Ground. In that case, Spotify said it declined to renew the deal. It was reported at the time that the couple had disagreed with Spotify over the number of its shows that would feature the former U.S. President and First Lady. The Obamas later inked a first-look deal with Amazon's Audible instead. Since stepping back from royal life, Harry and Meghan have focused on making money through media ventures, including the podcast, the 38-year-old prince's tell-all autobiography Spare and an agreement with Netflix to producing streaming content, including a docuseries about their relationship with Britain's royal family. Most recently, Harry has been in the UK as part of a phone hacking trial being heard in the High Court, where he has alleged he was the victim of phone hacking and other illegal information gathering tactics by tabloid media.